In this video, I will show you a step-by-step -step process of how to verify your Facebook business manager. And someone may ask, why do you need to verify your business manager? You need to verify your business manager in order to have access to Facebook developer features, in order to have access to Facebook business, uh, WhatsApp business API, in order to have access to, um, let's say if you create an app and you want to take certain actions that anyone who is not verified will not have. So there are a lot of benefits associated with um, having your business verified. It also lets Facebook know that you are doing a legal business and you are duly incorporated. And it also helps you, especially if you want to connect your Facebook shop to your commerce manager and to your website so that any update you make on your website will reflect on the page and on your commerce manager. And you will not have to be manually doing it. It will be automated. When you do take any action on the website, it will automatically appear on your page and your comments manager and all that. And it, it really helps your business a lot. So we want to take a step-by-step -step process of how we can um, verify our business manager. Okay. So if you are in your business settings, for example, let me go back to business settings. So let's say... You are under Facebook business settings, just like what you can see here. Um, okay, so let's say you are in Facebook business settings like this. You scroll down, scroll down to security center, and then you will see my own like this, uh, or this particular business manager, the verification is already required. But for some people, you may see an option like, you may see something like ineligible for verification. Okay, ineligible for verification. If you see ineligible for verification, let me give you an example of what you can do if you are if you are ineligible for verification, okay? If you are ineligible for verification, for example, you come here, okay? So as you can see this page, when you go to security center, you will see that this um, business manager is not um eligible for verification as you can see ineligible for verification so what we need to do is you need to scroll down you see apps so we need to create an app and when we create an app there are um certain options that we will turn on that will enable us um to to, to it will require us to be verified before we can access those features so we are going to create some app this is just a demonstration okay it's a demonstration so click on apps click on add Click on create new. Okay. So you have which use case do you want to add to your app? Get started by selecting the main case you like to add your app. You'll be asked to add permissions to your case, to your use case. Okay. So we select Facebook. You see, our most common use case, a secure, fast, and convenient way for users to log into your app and for your app to ask for permission um, to access their data. So you select Facebook. Click next. Okay, so which platform will you use your app? You'll be able to add more platforms after your app is created. Um, you can choose website. Okay, then are you building a game? So yes, I am building a game. Click next. Um, app name. So just make it try out app. okay add contact email i've already added business account optional um connecting a business account to your app is only required for certain products and permissions you'll be asked to connect a business account when you request access to those products and permissions so it's okay um it's a default option it's already connected to this business account so create app okay so you put your login details create the app okay so after creating your app like this you scroll down you can see app review then from there you see permissions and features you click this it will open and when you come to this particular part you will see um some of the features you already have uh, uh, i already have access when you scroll down you see one of them that will say require verification required so you click on that Okay, so when you scroll down, you will see something like start verification. And now, as you can see, we are now eligible for business verification. So we will go back 
to the business manager i was trying to do the verification and we continue it from there now when you come back here if you check um when you scroll down to business info you will see the business here it is indicated business verification status on verified okay to access certain facebook products your organization must be verified okay now you also have business information business details so we have the legal name of the business you must put it the country the street address the city and then every information here you must fill that form and then save it okay so after that is done you scroll down to security center then start verification we have two options organizations details and then identity documents so here we'll check your public records to confirm your authenticity you you may need to upload official documents and you will need to prove your connection to the company and then the second one is saying that identity document will review your personal document like a government issued photo id to confirm your identity so the first option is the company's details if it is a company or organization or any uh, once it is a registered entity like a, a registered or incorporated business you will be able to verify it with the first option so use the first option and make sure that this one you have entered the legal name of the business okay so these are the steps we will verify the organization details confirm the connection and upload the document so we click on get started so the country is the united states okay so the name is there the street address is there um city the province the zip code the number um the domain let me put a text id So we click on next. Well, they are saying that choose how you like to confirm your connection to Creativa LLC. Since we couldn't find a matching record, you will need to upload the documents to confirm the details you entered. So you can see Creativa LLC. You see the, the location and the phone number is there. Okay, so we're using phone number. Okay, so they will call this to confirm. Okay, so I'm using this option. So you upload the document you must have your certificate of incorporation available so you select it and as you can see they are saying the image must be in jpeg okay it must be in jpeg png or pdf okay so um ask to verify phone number let me see verify your phone number upload one of these accepted documents with the name address and phone number or upload two documents with name and address plus documents okay so the steps are a bit complicated you see uh, the options available the email option they will send a code to the email with your domain if you don't have a professional email with your domain you will have a problem okay and that one you also need to upload documents that have your legal name and address or phone number the second option you the, if you choose the phone call they will call you to give you the confirmation code and you also need to upload documents that have your legal organization name and the phone number the third option if you choose text messages you will have to um they will text a confirmation code to you and you need to upload documents that have your legal organization name and the phone number and the last one you will if you are using the domain verification um that one they will ask for a document that have your legal name your address and your phone number so looking at all the options i think the last option the domain verification may be better for me so i'm um, considering that one because that one the main thing they are looking for is your business name the address the phone number is also included but that is i'm sure that is not much as important as the domain and the address so i'm trying that because all the documents i have there is none that is 
having the phone number on the official document so that's the problem okay yeah so let me take this one so they are asking me to upload so i'm just so th these are the accepted documents they say verify your legal name so that one i'm uh, just uploading the certificate of incorporation okay so i'm uploading the certificate of incorporation okay so after you upload the certificate of incorporation and a document that has the address of your phone number in most countries if your company is incorporated you will have two documents and uh, sorry um one major document which is the certificate of incorporation and then you will have other documents which has the address and the details and the rules and regulations of the company in that details those details and the rules and regulations and the um address of the company if you have that one you can upload it you can upload a pdf document of that which has the address of the company and then you uh, you submit it okay you click on next and then you follow the process and submit it in fact some of the documents for me to submit is not yet they are not yet complete so i'm not going to submit it but if you follow it and submit it within um 48 hours sometimes it can take up to one week they will review it and they will get back to you and your business will be verified thank you for watching remember to subscribe to this channel turn on the notification bell and we uh, as we always do more powerful videos that will help you to be able to improve upon your digital marketing and make more sales online once again thank you and then bye bye but last before i forget if you have any problem remember to leave them in the comment section okay if you have problems remember to leave them in the comment section and then you can also follow our whatsapp link to whatsapp us so that we can help you if you have any additional problems if you are also trying to run ads but it is not converting please whatsapp us we'll still help you also check the testimonies on the screen we have worked for several people across the globe and if you contact us those testimonies you are seeing on the screen will also give you the best service that you can also testify like just what you are seeing so um follow the channels uh, just follow the procedures if you need to contact us and we will help you okay then see you in the next video bye